Hello my fellow subscribers, welcome to this easy quick tip on Windows on how to record your video games with a simple program which is kind of not free, it's the only available one. The others out there are better, but they're more expensive. And this program is called Fraps, it's well known around the world, so basically to get it go to www.fraps.com. Once you're at the page, this is it. The newest release is 3.0, it has stereoscopic 3D vision capture, it's Windows 7 uh, compatible supports for DirectX 11 and all the following things that are coming up on it and it can capture audio devices let's say your microphone the downside of it is that when you get the free version um, they have a logo at the bottom left or right of your screen of Fraps logo and the other bummer part about the program is that huh, the file size is huge let's say I go into my computer I think I have a Fraps folder let me just check it out yeah, when you just record a simple video, the size is humongous. Look at that, 166 megabytes. If your video is 10 minutes long, who knows? It might be 3 gigabytes big. And to compress it, you need a proper program, let's say like a Sony Vegas or something on your computer that can convert it into a Windows Movie video. Because the default format for it is an AVI, and AVIs are big. But yeah, this is the program. Um, just go ahead and get the download it and install it. Basically, what you do with it is double-click on Fraps this should open up from it and the interface is quite different if you are a previous user of Fraps but this is how it should look like on, uh, if you notice here it says unregistered when you have the free version it says it has a Fraps watermark and a bunch of other things that you should check up on and if you go into the 99 FPS up here and it should show uh, where it saves the benchmarks and whatnot the movies if you click here you press F9 when you're playing a game let's say Halo so let's try it out and go ahead and edit all the settings that are necessary here you can record external inputs and if your computer lags take this for notice if it lags when you record it depends on your graphics card that is the downside because you need to have an advanced graphics card if you record at a high resolution there's a lot of the things to elaborate and explain about but I cannot be because I'm doing this on screencasting you see my screen is very big because I'm trying out the game in a big resolution and if I start recording is as it's lagging now this is how bad it will be if you have a low graphics card so yep that's pretty much it so once you're done recording and you go to the directory the easy way to go to the directory is open up fraps go to movies and click on view to view the folder where it saved it now when you open it up and you double click and open up the program and you watch the video you notice the logo at the bottom right when you open it up you should notice fraps at the end of it or on the video itself unfortunately for me there's nothing I mean uh, at the top of it it says fraps.com that's the downside of it so that's basically it that's fraps you just press F9 to record you can check out all the other settings in the program it's a basic program the downside as I said is that it's not free you have to pay for it but it's free for enough time it just has a logo and the file size is huge but that's uh, normal so uh, that's pretty much it this is Fraps for your computer